Hey y'all, I am back with another crossword puzzle. I know it's been a while. So because this whole Jada Pinkett situation is such a hot topic and um, I saw a few of my uh, fellow astrologer friends post the videos. I was like, let me get on this, in on this. Now I haven't watched their videos yet. So I'm just going to provide my thoughts on it based upon Jada Pinkett's chart. And also I was going to look at Will Smith's chart and look at August as well. So a lot of you guys already know that uh, Jada had her red table talk and she was sitting across from Will Smith. Let me get started with this puzzle while I'm talking. So she was sitting across from Will Smith and they had their little uh tay to tay is that what you would call it and um she was basically saying that she basically admitted that they did have some type of an affair and she called it an entanglement so i'm going to tell you why she chose that term entanglement in particular now i don't know if she did it consciously in terms of uh her knowledge of things or if she did it subconsciously but i i found this today when i was looking at her chart and i thought it was quite amusing so uh let me just select a puzzle i'm going to select the most recent one it's called inkin and while i'm doing this puzzle we're going to see if there's any words that have to do with this current situation involving jada and this entanglement and then um also we're going to see if there's any words that relate to this current ether crisis and also i wanted to get into that situation with um naya rivera if i have time because one of my students uh put me on to this story i didn't even know who naya rivera was so i had to look her up and everything like that but that story is tragic so i wanted to get into that because i was looking at her chart so let me just click on this puzzle and get started and of course i'm going to be bouncing back and forth between charts and this crossword puzzle. So if this is your first time, uh, if you're a new subscriber, this is some of what I do. So I have Mars and Gemini ruling my third house. So I love crossword puzzles. I love word games in general. So I like to mix things up every now and then. So, and I like to multitask. So I'm gonna be talking about Jada Pinkett in this situation. I'm gonna be piggybacking off of what I said during my most recent live stream because I'm still holding firm to what I said, and I'll get to that in a minute. But what I'm gonna do tonight is show you why I said what I said. And the thing is, I was basically looking at some of their aspects together and I wasn't even noticing some of the things when I said what I said, but it basically confirms my beliefs. So again, title for a German woman. Is it something with an H? Nope already i'm rusty so it's been a while i have not done a crossword puzzle since i uploaded the last one droop would that be sag no it couldn't be sag already i am rusty musabi me i don't know what that is hate down some instagram posts ads yeah i hate those ads especially the ads for the mask ages old no, ages ago. Eleven down, when I am older, singer and frozen too. Older? I guess not. Some of y'all probably laughing because some of y'all probably know that, but I don't. Address starting with HTTP, AOL? No, URL. Told you I'm rusty. But anyway, um, so again, Jada had her red table talk. So I did say during my live live stream that she would be, you know, making a public statement and she would start off saying that she was only trying to help, but you know, she did admit it. So she went back on her initial statement because her initial statement, I believe it was a flat out denial, but then she came clean and said that she was involved with August Alcina, but she would not say the word affair or romance or, uh, sexual relationship. She didn't get specific. She said, well, it was an entanglement. Desire for more and more. Read. 
I feel like Jada Pinkett is greedy. And she gets what she wants at the end of the day. She got some really good aspects in her chart. Bigelow beverage tea. Oh, damn. Sometimes that happens. I think it's because they done uh, ramped up their uh, tracking devices on these um, internet. Kitchen professional chef. Well, it is cancer season, and uh, cancer is the sign of the chef. Olaf. Okay, I don't know who Olaf is. I don't watch Frozen. Nail polish layer coat. She was trying to sugarcoat things. Speaking of coat, she was trying to sugarcoat things on that red table. Now, Will look kind of raggedy. Usually, he looks really put together, but it looked like he lost a few nights sleep. It looked like, first of all, that's another thing I wanted to say. I feel like her doing the red table talk was more so for Will's sake than her own. I think if she had it her way, she wouldn't have even addressed the issue unless he would have kept on drumming on about it. But um, I think this was really for Will. I think it's basically about Will at the end of the day. And that's why Jada is not going to divorce him because they made this pact, whether it's with the devil or with God, I don't know, but it's like these two made this pact and they are not splitting it up for nobody. And it was almost like a slap in the face. Well, it was like a slap in the face for August. Balance facilitating organ here. So it was like, it was a slap in the face for August because she basically let it be known like at the end of the day, I'm riding with Will. Like, I don't care who the hell I mess with. And she basically reduced uh august down to an entanglement which we're going to get into in a minute officially approved author author authorized authorized maybe he's going to come out with an authorized biography or autobiography <laughs> whatever 36 across the big sick actress kazen i don't know who that is zia z can't be many Z words. Zoe. I'm tripping. All right, 39 across. Employee voice to text software. Oh, and I got another video natal chart reading coming up. So stay tuned for that. I'm almost finished with it. I should be uh, able to upload it probably by this Friday or Saturday. So stay tuned. I know my client's been waiting patiently for it. And um, I'm just so happy that it's almost complete. And you're going to really like this one. 42 across, some health professionals. AIDS. I'm going to get to Jada's chart in one second. 32 down, electric ills. I really don't see what she saw in August. I mean, he's all right looking, but he just got this lost look to him and it makes sense because he got mars and gemini and can join to his gemini self no he don't know whether he's coming or going and that hair that current hairstyle proves it 31 down sauce that may include chocolate sauce oh mole i had some homemade mexican food tonight um 39 across employee voice to text software employee tell oh no employee why can't i get this i'll come back to that I'll it. 42 them palindromic name ada asa no anna 46 across hello blank adele Larry. i don't know that oh no that's abbreviation for a corporation inc 39 down, employee voice to text software. Oh, I had it wrong. 39 across, HP competitor, Dell. Oh, dictate. But yeah, that story about um, Maya Rivera, I'm like, First of all, it's fishy to me. You know me. I, I rarely believe the official story. So I'm already asking questions. 62 chapters of history, eons or eras. 
errors. Fifty nine across. I don't know why he's doing that, but that freaks me out. But anyway, um, if you watched my last live stream, you saw that I was kind of tripping towards the end when I was talking about this ether situation and everything. And I was, you know, going on about how our freedoms are being taken away and stuff. So I did have a little minor solution. So last night I went to the store real late at night, like an hour before they closed and there was hardly nobody in there. So that really helped fabric shelter tent. That really helped because I didn't have to see all those people just around with all the, you know, the face coverings and all that stuff because that really freaks me out. I'm not used to seeing this stuff. I'm from the old school. I mean, even if you're not from the old school, nobody's used to seeing this stuff. But for some people, you know, I guess it's okay with them. It freaks me out seeing everybody walking around like that, including myself. So also, when I was in there, you know, I was kind of had my thing kind of down. I'm not even trying to talk all explicitly because I'm paranoid at this point. I feel like the secret police is all around us and shit, just listening in. But I did my little civil disobedience, I guess you would say, and I didn't have my uh, covering all the way up, if you know what I'm saying. Food informally. So for now on, if I got to do some food shopping, I'll be going either very late at night or very early in the morning as soon as they uh, open. Because I'm not, I'm not the one. 51 down. Food informally eats. Okay, I'm about to get over it to um but anyway, August has Mars and Gemini conjoined to his Gemini South Node. That's somebody that could easily get played. 50 down. Mother of Solange and Beyonce, Tina. And again, I said that's somebody he don't know whether he's coming or going. Now I know that has to do with his brother too, because then his brother get killed and shot or something like that. So that deals with the brother situation, but it also deals with his actions. And it can also mean that he misinterprets things very easily. So he misinterpreted Jada's uh, interactions with him as something real, some real relationship, but she just saw it as, you know, that's her little pet project. That's her little plaything for the minute, for the moment. And she got sun to join the Pluto. So that type of person, when they're through with you, they could just discard you like you're a dirty maxi pad. 56 across Cambodia's continent, Asia. I can't stop this crossword puzzle. It feels so good right now. I haven't done one in a minute. Um, what is that? My uh, law. Law. Oh, that deals with the each. Oh, and of course it blacked out right there. This deals with the ether statue because that's what they're trying to say now that oh it's a statue that you have to put this on your face i've been uh learning a lot about the law too state law thanks thanks to uh the health what's her name damn i forget her name but she's a good um she has a really good channel where she's not um she's not trying to deal with this bullshit either uh 46 or 48 down it feels so good to have, you know, at least there's some YouTube channels where, you know, it's like-minded people. Graduated Garland. I don't know right now. Is it Boa? 61 across. Donate. Lynn? No. Donate. 58 across. Quantity of paper. Yo, just keep doing this. Is it roll or ream? 48 down. And for all my people in California, sorry about this uh, second lockdown, but I feel like they're about to do it in all the states. If you notice, they were doing that slowly with every, you know, with a succession of states with the whole covering your face thing. Graduation Garland, is it lay? I guess so. All right, let me go to Jada Pickett's chart. So like I said, Jada has sunk to join the Pluto. Now you don't take people like that lightly. And, oh shit, all right. So 
you don't take people like that lightly. So she got that sun can join the Pluto hookup. So like I said, that very much deals with Will Smith, but that also deals with August Alsina in terms of her lending her support to him and helping him out. But like I said, when somebody with this conjunction is done with somebody, they could just drop them like a hot potato or just discard them like they're a dirty piece of trash. So apparently that's what it seems like she did with him. Like she felt like maybe she felt like she did all she could to help him out. And now, you know, she probably sent him on his merry way talking about, okay, we're done. Now, Jada has some aspects in her chart that shows that she basically is in an open marriage. And that's been rumored for many years, even though Will Smith and Jada has never came out and said that. Now, if you see right here, Venus is conjoined to Pluto. So that right there can manifest as an open marriage or where there's a lot of infidelity going on. I always say when there's Pluto or Scorpio in the mix, you can never assume that your partner is fully yours. Sometimes it can be the case, but I just say don't ever assume that to be the case. So with that Venus could join the Pluto, that can deal with her being able to have relationships on the side and Will Smith perhaps as well. Now, again, this is nothing new because this has been rumored for many years about them that they've had an open marriage. Also, like they used to have sex parties and all that. And that Venus can join the Pluto can deal with orgies, sex parties, group sex, all that good stuff. And also, let me just clear this. So she also has, that Venus can join the Pluto can also deal with, again, the August Alcina situation too, especially from the standpoint of Pluto being at the 29th degree of Virgo, that's her helping somebody out and then ending up getting a bit too into it where it actually turns into some type of relationship. So maybe she really didn't intend upon, you know, things turning sexual or romantic or whatever, but that's how it ended up. Or maybe she did set out to do that and then she didn't realize she would get caught up in the process because with this Venus can join the Pluto, yeah, you can get caught up. Somebody could take revenge upon you, expose your shit, all types of stuff. All right. Also, this is another aspect that deals with August and Jada. Mercury can join to Juno in Virgo. So again, she really was trying to help him out, but there were strings attached. And the strings attached basically dealing with the fact that he had to be of service to her, if you know what I'm saying. So he had to be of service to her in exchange for the help that she was providing. And these quincunx aspects to Mars and the North Node points to that. So I'm thinking like she probably had him rubbing her feet, licking her cooch, like rubbing her back, doing all types of stuff but she probably wasn't doing much for him in return. And the reason why I say that is for a couple of reasons, but let's get right down to the nitty gritty about why she used the term entanglement. Because I might have to make this a part two because um, I gotta get ready for a class that I'm about to teach. And I know I said I was gonna do part two for this other video, I forgot. you. First of all, you know I got Mars and Gemini and I'm a Sagittarius. That is a bad combination for trying to hold me to something. Now, if it's something dealing with, you know, my clients, oh yeah, I got you. But if it's something dealing with like videos and stuff, I'm sorry. I'm gonna get I'm gonna try to get to it when I can, but it's it's hard sometimes. But I'm gonna really try to get better with the video stuff. So please just bear with me. And I, we're coming off of Venus and Mercury being in retrograde. So also y'all got to cut me a little slack where I was like missing in action for a while and all that stuff. But as you can see, I'm trying to really be more present. And also I'm just taking a break from the work that I was doing. So I got several nail charts, orders and um, solar returns and synastry that I got to do. But I can always take more because guess what? I don't have a man. I don't have a love life. So uh, I don't have nobody breathing down my neck, occupying my time like Jada had with August and Will. But I, you know what? I don't think Will is hardly around, though. So 
I really don't think Will really cares. Again, I think Will was more so like, Jada, don't let nobody, I mean, I think they've always had that, like, keep it clean. That could be very Virgo. Keep it clean. And Will got Mars in Virgo. This is a Virgo story all day. Um, keep it clean. <laughs> like, don't let it out. And I, I, I just feel it in my heart that he warned the Jada because he's a Libra too. He probably warned her. He was probably like, yo, don't mess with young boy. <laughs> don't, like, for real. This, he probably could see that he would be the type that would, you know, spill the tea. But anyway, let's cut to the chase because I think I'm going to make this into a part two because I got to get ready and go. But anyway, if we look at her asteroids, this right here is the reason why she used the word entanglement. So she got Mars. Let me get my drawing tool. She got Mars and the North Node conjoined to Arachne. And Arachne is an asteroid that deals with entanglements. Oh, what a tangle where we weave. When those something we deceive or something, what is it called? So she got caught up. I always say Arachne is about getting caught up. It's getting caught up in a web, getting caught up in a web of lies, deceit, or intrigue, or it could be sex. It could even be like sex ring. And like I was telling my student um, earlier, like it could be like a prostitution ring. Not saying this is true in Jada's case, but the key word to keep in mind is entanglement. And that's arachne all day. And with Mars there, that Mars is represented August Alcina, especially because his Saturn is conjoined to, no, wait a minute, where is it? Yeah. His Saturn is conjoined to her Mars and North Node. So that right there is pointing to the entanglement. So again, I wonder if she knows her chart like that, where she knows she got Mars conjoined to Arachne and she purposely chose that term. Or I'm wondering if she subconsciously said that. Now she has other aspects that could deal with an entanglement. But this is the chief aspect right here. Mars conjoined to Arachne, which is why she chose those words. Now, she has Mars trying Uranus in her chart, which basically gives her free reign to do what she wants while she's in a marriage. Because Mars is in um, Aquarius and Uranus is in Libra. Like, that's an aspect of an open marriage right there. But that can also deal with her friendships especially with her friendship with August Alcina. They're both all at the 12th degree. Now, mind you, that 12th degree deals with sacrifice and victim. So August was the victim in this case. But let me tell you about the sacrifice part. I truly believe, and I'm standing by what I said in that um, most recent live stream, that Jada was stringing him along. I really doubt that she went all the way and had vaginal sex with him. But I do believe that they got sexually active but I feel like it was more for her benefit than his. And they have some aspects that point to this. So first of all, the Virgo energy alone can deal with where she's acting prudish. Now we all know, well, I don't know if you know this, but Jada did admit on one time that she was hypersexual, but she said she overcame that. So she does have Mars, Sesquicare, Square, Pluto, which would result in, can result in somebody being hypersexual, but it can also point to someone basically reeling somebody in with their uh, lusty ways, but not sealing the deal. And she has Mars, Sesame Square Sun, which can deal with basically the same thing, like her toying around with men. That also deals with August versus Will Smith. So that Mars, Sesame Square Sun deals with the fact that um, August brought Will Smith into the mix, and Will is highly irritated. He and then the whole situation with Fifty Cent, Fifty Cent messaging Will Smith, and basically uh, make basically turning the knife or pushing the knife deeper in his back. But again, I feel like Jada went on the red table talk mainly to preserve Will Smith's dignity and reputation. Now. Um, Jada's son is conjoined to Eros, and that, that's another um, aspect that could point to her being very sexual, but that can also point to a lover that she has that's younger than her, because we're talking about this Virgo energy, 
and Virgo does denote youthfulness and even this sense of innocence. So she probably saw a sense of innocence and vulnerability in him and she capitalized on it. But that 12 again deals with victim and the sacrifice could deal with the sacrifice August had to make in terms of being with her. So again, uh, some of the things that could point to where he wasn't getting fully satisfied sexually in this relationship is that his Chiron is conjoined to her south node. Matter of fact, let me do a bywill of this. Did I? Oh, that's her transit chart. See, I got to get into her transit chart too. But I might not have time and I got to get back to this puzzle. Um, what am I looking for? Oh, I got to put their two charts together. Just one second. All right. Now, I don't know Jada's time of birth. It's not listed, but we can still talk about things like this conjunction right here. So August Chiron is on Jada's uh, south node. So again, this could deal with where she's toying around with him because Chiron could deal with wounding. And she probably did, you know, they did. It is funny because they showed this picture of him in the hospital and talk about, yeah, he was really sick when you first started dealing with him. But he has Chiron opposition Saturn in his natal chart. And then Jada fits right in the mix. So this can deal with where someone is leading him on, but they never seal the deal sexually because we're talking about that Aquarius energy can deal with non-sexual activities or platonic friendships. So again, I feel like Jada was getting sexual gratification. She really emphasized that on that red table talk because she was like, I just need to feel good or something like that. I might be misquoting, but she said something about feeling good. And she got, she used the baritone voice with that. So uh, Chiron could join to her Leo South node, but then also opposing her Mars and Aquarius and her Aquarius North node. And then when you add in his Saturn and Aquarius in the mix, that could deal with again, where he was serving her up, but she necessarily wasn't giving him full sexual uh, gratification, and it could be the vaginal part. Hell, I'm, I was even thinking that she might have been pegging him because he got that Mars and Gemini could join to the Gemini South Node, so he probably is bisexual, but he probably never really want that to get out. Now, I don't really know nothing about this dude, so maybe he is out of the closet. Y'all let me know, but there was something else dealing with his inability to seal the deal and aspects dealing with where she's playing him so his son is in quincunx to her chiron so here's his son so that could deal with where again she's stringing him along and with his son being in virgo he's serving her up but she's not really giving him what he needs fully and that chiron's in aries and that could deal with her you know the sexual tension that's between the two of them and the sexual frustration on his part with his son in Virgo. So again, he was probably pleasing her in a number of ways. Now she probably gave him pleasure too, but again, because she's so controlling with that son could join the Pluto, she also got Venus could join the Pluto. I could see her toying around with him like that. She also has Mercury can join the Juno, like I said, and Mercury could join the Siwa. And when I saw that, I was like, oh wow, that could be her telling him that she don't want to have sex vaginally because she don't want to get pregnant. Now, Jada is kind of up there in age, but she could still be fertile. And if she's not still fertile, she could be lying about it. So again, that's another indication that I'm seeing. A um, couple more things before I get back to this crossword puzzle. August Mercury is square in Jada's Neptune and Jupiter. So that could deal with where, again, he was very confused dealing with her. He was deceived. She probably led him on thinking that 
their little fling was something more than what it really was, but it was all for her benefit at the end of the day. Now she might have helped him out in some ways. I'm trying to find the website. Oh, okay. So she thank you. So she probably helped him out in a number of ways, but again, I don't see her giving him fully what she what he wanted. Because another thing that I talked about too, she's so controlling that if she was to give him what she wanted, what he wanted, and that could be vaginal sex, then I could see her, if he put it on her real good, then she wouldn't be in control anymore. Fauna's counterpart, Flora, then she wouldn't be in control anymore. Because when a man puts it on you real good, it's not easy to maintain control anymore. Title for a German woman. Oh, I think I noticed. I'll move on. Five across. Turquoise relative aqua. Aquarius. There you go. Her Mars conjoined to the north node in Aquarius. She throw his Saturn in Aquarius. That's all that, like that opposition with Aquarius and Leo, that's that sexual tension right there. Like that's, oh, we're supposed to be in platonic friendship. I can't go all the way with you, but we gonna lay in bed together naked and we gonna like play with each other's genitals and stuff like that. But I'm sorry, I can't give it all to you and stuff, but you could go down on me and you could lick the carpet and do all what you want down there but you can't stick it in like i could see that being the case and when his mars and gemini could join to the gemini south node that could deal with where he's not getting everything he wants what where he gets what he wants in piecemeal with that north node in sagittarius he's supposed to get the whole enchilada but he probably didn't wear her and that's why he's so pissed off too because he realized he was played that he was being strung along for her own little pleasure and amusement Numerical target. Numerical target. Get blank in the door. Oh, get a foot in the door. But again, I see Jada as being very crafty in that respect. Now, let's say she did actually have sex with him. Again, if that's the case, I'd still say she made it very one-sided, bust up shut. And that could be very much sun could join the Pluto type people too. Now, if some of y'all got sun could join the Pluto, I'm sorry. You know, sometimes that could be projected onto other people if you don't own that yourself. Like if it's a woman or a gay man, you could project that onto a man that you're dating or that you get married to. Bust up shut. You know what? I'm starting to lose interest right now. I might um, close this out because I can't even think right now. Collared shirts, polos. And I'm hyped because I, I just like I got a bunch of stuff to do. I got a class to teach in less than 45 minutes. 12 down must be me. See, I can't think straight right now. But I really feel like Jada played him. And I feel, actually, I don't feel bad for the dude. I'm like, shoot, support financially. I'm like, you live and you learn. That's all part of the whole love game. You're going to get your heart broken. And with Jada having that Leo South note, you know, she knows about all about getting her heart broken. So with her being older and wiser, I could see her really holding back on the full-fledged sex because she don't want to get her heart broken. She don't want to get all torn up inside over some young boy. Support financially, fund. Yeah, she was probably funding him in a number of ways too, and he got all caught up, got all in love. Seven down, ill-suited. Um, withdrawal gradually. Steve? No. Oh my God, I am so rusty. 48 down, 60, uh, let's see, 53 down. Organization with icing penalties. What's the hockey? Um, H, I don't know, A NHL. Okay, 52 down. Letters on a Crystal Dunn jersey, I don't know. 60 across, bitter beers, ales. 61 across, donate, donate. 
54 down. 54 down. Female deer, that's a doe. But yeah, y'all let me know what you think. I might have to close this puzzle out early. Corporate head CEOs. 45 down, stabilizing muscles. But um, let's talk about Will Smith real quick because without looking at his chart, I can remember some of his placements. So Will Smith has Sun conjoined to his Libra South Node. So we already know with that hookup, he's going to have serious issues involving his marriage. 45 stabilizing muscles. Abs. And he, they did mention on the Red Table Talk that they had broken up while she was seeing August, but I doubt that. They were probably still, you know, together, but not together. Because I don't think they've been together for many years. But they've been together, like, financially. Like, I believe it's mainly a financial situation. And I believe that Jada is Will Smith's beard, truth be told. And she was the woman that had his children. So for a gay man that wants children and that wants some semblance of a quote-unquote normal life where it seems like he's straight, why not? make some type of business deal with a woman and and let's be real uh will smith has sun conjoined to uranus as well um why not make some deal with a woman where you know she's going to keep her mouth shut as long as he keeps those coins coming law we already talked about that 48 down 46 oh hello it's me i love that song that is not Adele. Wait a minute. That's a cover song. I know they're not trying to donate. Why can't I think of donate? 44 across. Yen's counterpart. Yang. Okay, we're getting somewhere. I might be able to finish this. 41 across. French article. We? Oui? No, that's not an article. Um, Lay? Day? May? No. We'll go back to that. 33 down. Rise dramatic. Oh, and speaking of 33, that uh, Naya Rivera died at 33 years old. So I was like, my eyebrow raised with that too. Rise dramatically. 34. Must, musician ferment. Oh, they're really playing with me tonight with this crossword puzzle. Bad smells. Odors. 43 across. But yeah, uh, August Alcina, he learned a hard lesson with that South Node in Gemini, North Node in Sagittarius, dealing with two faced people. What else aspects they got? Moon square moon. So his moon in Sagittarius, her moon in Virgo. So her acting all coy, talking about, I can't do it because I'm married, but we can do this. That type of stuff. I'm trying to tell you. August, Mars, and South Node are square in Jada's Sun and Pluto. I forgot to mention that. So right there, that could deal with him pissing Will Smith off, number one. But that also deals with the fact that, like I said, she was being very controlling with this, and she probably wasn't giving it up fully for him. And she kept stringing him along, making her, her I mean, making him be at her service more so than it being a mutual thing in terms of pleasure numerical target quote oh quota so again don't underestimate that sun pluto conjunction so with that especially with it being in virgo as her wanting support and service from a man oh and because jada got uranus conjoining sappho i was telling somebody else this too I feel like Jada is about women for love and men for money and support in some ways. And maybe, you know, for them to service her up sexually in some ways, heirs, heirs, goofs. What y'all think about that? I never forget that picture she had when she was in that group Wicked Wisdom where she was tonguing that woman all down. Now that's who she really like with Uranus could join the Sappho. And she got Mars and Aquarius could join to her Aquarius North Node. Jada's really a lesbian, true and true, but she'll get down with men a little bit, you know, especially if they could give her pleasure or gratify her ego, like give her that ego gratification, make her feel good, stroke her ego and stuff. Um, 18 across, because 
let's be real, she is a Virgo. She got insecurity issues. So she's getting older. So to get attention from a young dude, oh yeah, that's going to boost her ego. That's going to make her feel good. 12 across. One across, title for a German word. Oh, frop, fra. There it is. I knew I knew it. Three down. Margaret Peterson had it, the what? Two down, measuring tool, ruler. She was probably spanking him with rulers and shit. That's probably his fantasy teacher with his Mars and Gemini could join to that South Node because you know Gemini deal with teachers and schools and shit. So she probably had a ruler out spanking him on the ass and he was like, teacher, I'm going to be good. Teacher, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to memorize my multiplication tables. Droop. I don't know, why can't I? 12 down, three down, four down. And I bet you they did a lot of late night talking where he was all stroking her and rubbing her back and making her feel good. 23 down, withdraw gradually. Why can't, oh, I'm terrible at this right now. Up to informally. That dude upstairs, he needs to be, I was going, I'm not even going to say it. You got to be careful what you say on YouTube nowadays. Exterior of a ship or a sea. Hull. See, I know a little bit about ships. Poisonous substance. Toxic? Toxin. Jada is toxic. 30 down. Up to informally. Up to informally. What the hell? This dude upstairs making all this damn noise like he don't have no damn sense. This man look like he's older than me making all this noise upstairs. Will, but... All right, Axel. 28 down. Old's opposite. Young. See? That deals with Jada because she wanted a little young thing to validate her. Up to informally. L? Oh, Till. And again, I feel like this was mainly for Will Smith's benefit. He got that son to join to the Libra South Node. And, you know, you got to think about that. Now, he did mention that his father was very strict and stuff like that. Withdrawal gradually. And that could deal with that son could join to the South Node. But also that deals with, you know, he got some issue with his marriage. He also got Taurus intercepted in the 12th, 57 across. He also got Taurus, oh, shook. Will Smith was shook, so was Jada. Um, also got um, Taurus intercepted in the 12th. And his Venus is, and then let me see, let me pull up his chart real quick. Because this is telling, too, and it made me think of that, you know, him and Jada always had this business arrangement, and it deals with the fact that she's his beard, because it's been rumored that he's been with Dwayne Martin for many years. So his Venus is in Libra, 29th degree, that's a love triangle, conjoined to Mercury, and then, and that deals with his relationship and marriage being highly publicized but they did it to themselves because they was the ones all in the news when they first got married acting like they was the best thing that have ever graced this earth in terms of a marriage but as you can see well no i don't have i didn't share it but taurus is intercepted in the 12th venus is in the sixth house 29th degree of libra conjoined to mercury at the 28th degree of libra that can deal with where he marries a woman that's going to help him out and help disguise the fact that he's really gay when it comes down to it. He also has Mars and Virgo squaring the Gemini ascendant. So that could deal with where there's some issue with his sexuality. Like his sexuality is not what he says it is. So that could deal with where he's living a double life. especially with Mercury conjoined to Venus. And then let's see his eighth house. He got Saturn on the eighth. Very much about keeping his sexual proclivities under wraps. Saturn's in the 12th. In Aries, secret attraction to men. All right, let's go on. And somebody that he works with, because we're talking about Saturn. That's Dwayne Martin right there. Hello. 
we need to put Dwayne Martin and um, Will Smith's chart up together one day. And when I was telling my uh, one of my students about it, she was like, oh, well, they do make a good couple. All right, rental car options, sedan. I am taking forever with this and time is winding down. Um, 27 down. Prefix for technology. But the reason why, uh, I also feel like the reason why Jada called it an entanglement is because, again, she wasn't fully into it like that. At least where she was giving him pleasure or allowing him to go all the way fully, rise dramatically, soar. 43 across, dorm community builders, RAs. 40 across, part of the symbol for Sagittarius. Arrow. Hey, that is meant to be, do y'all see that? They called me out, Sagittarius, part of the symbol for Sagittarius. I gotta finish this now. All right, you see how these uh, puzzles are um, deal with the synchronicity, like I told y'all. Music, is it Ezra? Okay. 37 across, UV ozone, I'm about to knock this out now. 52 down, USA, yeah. 52 across, promotes insufficiently under sales. All right, York, Sutton, New York. Home to is that up up salanti or oh, no up something upstate new york here we go all right we about to get it on 16 down but yeah y'all let me know what you think about uh my perspective on this situation fridays for future activists and again i went over some of the aspects that could deal with where she was just leading him on instead of you know, giving him fully what he wanted, withdrawal gradually. And I think she got off on it, got off on the fact that he wanted her so bad vaginally and she couldn't, he, she wouldn't get that part of herself up. Fridays for future activists. What? Fridays for future activists. Green? We'll come back to that. All right, I gotta hurry up. 12 down, slump. I mean, 12 across, 12 down, Musabi meat. Spam? I guess. 18 across, Nikita's people blank homes. People are, people aren't homes. Three down, Margaret Peterson's haddocks among the hidden. What's this? Margaret. Wow. Margaret Dowd. Oh, Dowd. Nope. I can't believe I'm running out of time. 23 down, withdraw gradually. I still can't get that. 24 across, bit of ink. Tad, tap, tap, Greta, I know that's not that chick, is that that, oh no, that's that crazy chick, isn't it, Greta Thurnberg or something, 61, wow, I can't believe she's in a crossword puzzle now, donate, give, I should have been got that. Slav, oh my God, this one day at a time. All right, we about to take this home, y'all. But again, I might do a part two. I said might, don't uh, hold it to me. Withdraw gradually. Ween, Greta, Margaret, Atwood, I'm fit. Okay, I got it. So again, let me know what you think in the comment section. And let me know if you want me to do part two where I get, but I'm like, 
what is there more to talk about, really, if I think about it? I mean, I could talk about the transit she's going through real, real quick. Uh, let me see if I got time to talk about that. Some of the transits that, oh, she did have something square, her nodes. I mean, the transiting nodes. That's right. So the transiting nodes around the time that this story broke were squaring her Pluto. And this was on June 30th. So when did that story first break? I don't got time to look this up. But just know that the transiting nodes were squaring her Pluto in Virgo. So that deals with information being leaked because we're talking about North Node in Gemini, South Node in Sagittarius, the truth coming out, truth being revealed, truth being exposed, and with August being the one to do it. Also, she has Uranus making, uh, what is that? Actually, Uranus is in trying with her Mercury and Juno. So this actually worked out in her favor, you could say, maybe. She did seem like she was amused by it all. Maybe she's going to capitalize on this even further. And then Pluto and Jupiter, Sesqui Square, Mercury and Juno. So that could deal with that information being out there as well. And her being, uh, what's that word? Her being scorned, you can say. All right, but I got to go. So again. Let me know if you want me to do a part two. But then again, like I said, I don't think I need to do a part two because I think I covered mostly, mostly everything I wanted to say, if not everything. So stay tuned for more videos. I'm working on my Venus and Gemini video, so please stay tuned for that. I'll definitely have it out before Venus leaves Gemini. Also, stay tuned for a special video that features another video natal chart reading one of my clients ordered one and wanted me to put it on youtube so stay tuned for that i should have that in a couple of days and stay tuned for the next live stream if you would like a reading you could go to my website at rabina.com peace and many blessings